it's PTG from P oh well <laughs> from PTG Productions and today we are doing the second episode of our Let's Play. So the last episode got some good responses. It wasn't like the most popular video that I've done on the channel. Uh yeah, I don't exactly know what to say for that. It's gonna be nighttime pretty soon, I presume, because I was just going through and did a few things off camera. Um, the thing I mostly did off camera was collect these snowballs, and i pretty sure I killed the squid off camera too. I just did a tiny bit of work like that. Now, in the comments section, you guys didn't give me an exact place to build our base. I'm thinking what we're going to need to do is make like a stairway from here. I think since we've already made our base here, I think we should just start off where it is I think it's in a fine location. Uh, personally, I really like the location that's in at the moment. So what I'm thinking that we're gonna need to do is make a stairway that goes all the way down here, and then we can also lead that to whatever else or whatever else we build. And remember, I was saying in the last episode at the very top, I want to have a lighthouse so we can look over the whole world because I love looking at Minecraft because Minecraft is awesome, and I, th I think the 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 scenery can be really awesome when you have your render distance pretty high and now I do only have about 60 FPS again this is really weird guys because I was just on a server and got like a hundred FPS so um, I really do think that it's because it's recording so that kind of stinks but I do I remember I do have the optifine mod yeah so basically today we're gonna do a little bit exploring. I'm gonna show you guys the world. I'm gonna put some stuff in the chest here. So if I accidentally do get lost, I can just kill myself. I hope I don't get lost, but you just I'm I get lost all the time in Minecraft just because I do. I I'm, I'm kind of embarrassed that I get lost so much. I go on Pocket Edition to try and find a wolf. Um, next next thing you know, I'm lost. I, I'm not kidding. <laughs> So I'm gonna keep my stone sword, and I think that's the only thing I'm going to keep in my inventory. And I'm gonna get, actually, I'm going to get, do I have any food? I have this food here. So I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna kill probably a chicken or two out there. Oh, look, there's one here. He already wants me to eat fried chicken out of him. I really do wish that Minecraft would add fried chicken into the game. That would be fantastic. Because I love fried chicken in real life, and no one can tell me not to. So, okay, Doki. So, basically, this world has a lot of animals, but not too, too many mobs are spawning. I don't get that. I have not turned off, um, uh, what's it called? Dif the difficulty at all. It's still on normal. I don't get that why it's not spawning mobs. So, let's just kill this pig here. They're going to spawn they're gonna I'm more gonna spawn so basically over here there is just a biome it's a big biome this is where our base is here and then over here is just a huge forest uh, biome literally there's nothing to explore over there it's literally just trees I did a little bit of exploring off camera but it's legit just trees so yeah there's nothing really to show over there over here though we have like a whole lake which will be like great for when we go fishing and that'll be cool we have some squids over there and we can get some ink sacks and get some pretty cool leather armor okay over here we have a little bit more of a stream for fishing and stuff like that and over oh, what's this i guess a little entrance to another cave and over here what we have this is probably the oh darn i need i need my food probably the best part about this world other than our huge um, hill that we have over there. Oh, look, we have lava. Oh, yeah. The, the ravine is probably the coolest part about this world. I really like this. I collected a tiny bit of iron, and we have our zombie friends that are all the way down there. I looked at them earlier, and they are pretty cool. I'm gonna have to do some of that mining off camera, because it gets really boring, and I can show you guys what I got. Over here, I've never been to yet, but let's just explore, because we have the time and then when it turns nine time we can go back home to sleep and then we can start working on the inside of our base now I have no idea what this biome is called but I actually really like the way it looks because I just really like stone stone is cool to me I, I, I do like stone 
So basically we just have some planes over there, not too much to look at, just some huge freaking hills. Um, I'm sorry, but <laughs> like we have huge hills here. So I think that's basically the entire world because our world has tons of flatlands, but it has tons of hills at the same time. So we have extreme, we have a extreme hills biome wrapped around with the forest biome, which is wrapped around by a plains biome. It's, it's pretty insane. It's, it's, it's a pretty cool map. I really do like this map. Now, what, uh, where is the sun? It's still up there. I'm very surprised. So I'm gonna go to our house and cook some of this meat. We might venture to behind the hill. I've never done that before, but I did go on top of the hill off camera and it is pretty cool to look at the scenery. It, it looks amazing. Oh, look at our fried chicken. But it seriously looks amazing and I used my entire shovel's worth of snowballs. So we have tons of snowballs and I have no idea what we can use snowballs for, but maybe we can use them in our house to make it look cool and we won't have to get nether quartz, which we will end up getting nether quartz later in this series. But right now, I'm more worried about getting our house done and then slowly as we go, we can go to the nether and then our initial goal is to fight the ender dragon and complete the series. Now there are so many things I have that I want to do and yeah, it's, I'm just trying to waste a little bit of time because it's nighttime and my food is cooking, but then we can start working on the base. Now I'm going to talk about the base for a little bit. Basically we're going to have a huge room. It's going to be basically where this is because I did a little bit of planning and th we're going to have a huge room basically where this is. It's going to be like the, the walk-in enjoy room and then there's going to be like three different branches, like a branch that goes on this side, a branch that, oh sorry, a branch that goes on that side and a branch that goes on this side and they're all going to wrap around like basically this, this, this floor is going to be kind of like floating and then they're all going to wrap around to another floor that goes on the bottom that has tons of our stuff and then there will also be tons of just places that go everywhere and all that jazz and that's basically what today I just want to make the outline of this room with with our pickaxe here with our stone pickaxe I might actually make a um, no, not, not that. a do I have do I do I have three iron I, I swore I had oh yeah, yes I did so I have one two no why did I do that so I have three iron here, and I'm gonna make an iron pickaxe, because what if we find diamonds? That would be pretty cool. So now I'm gonna get some wood here, and I'm going to make some sticks, because sticks are awesome. And we are going to make our pickaxe. Now by this time, it should be nighttime, and I'm gonna wait a tiny bit, because I want to see if mobs will actually spawn on this world. Because they're supposed to spawn, but I have not seen a single mob that's that that's that's not in the ravine. Because I saw a couple in the huge one that's down there, but no mobs have spawned anywhere else, which is really confusing. So I'm just gonna wait a second. So wait, no, yeah, okay. So I'm just gonna wait a second. I'll cut when it's nighttime. We are back, and it is turning nighttime. The sun just went down. The sunset was beautiful, as is every day in Minecraft. So I'm just gonna wait. Probably about 10 seconds now, which is already counting down, just to wait to see if any mobs will spawn over there, or over there, or over there, or over yonder way, or whatever. So it is officially night time. So if mobs are gonna spawn, they've already spawned. Or So yeah, let's go into our nice, not so cozy two black eye room that we're gonna basically create the rest of some the next Minecraft day. And then after we do the Minecraft day, we are going to finish up this episode. I'm gonna just check outside, did, did any mob spawn? Are you serious? I'm gonna seriously, is, is that a glitch or something? Cause I mean, I'm fine with not too, too many mobs, but I'm just like, that. that's taken them out of the Minecraft experience. So let's just pick up this bed here and let's take up this chest. And I don't know why I'm using my pickaxe for that. And let's just pick up this and pick up this, and then we're just gonna make a chest really, really fast with the two chests. And then we're going to basically, oh yeah, go out of there. And then we're, we're going to make the outsides of our house. So let's just go, let's do this. Boom, 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 boom. 
That's good. So now I will have the speed through. Of it's gonna go a little bit speedier as I mine the base, like the beginning part of her base. Okay, oh wait, three, two, again. Okay, guys, we have just finished the base. Okay, we haven't finished the base, but we just finished the base of the opening part of the house. Now, basically, I have this an extra one up, and it's gonna go back down, and that's just because I already opened it up, so that means I can just place blocks on the top already, which is great, but I just need the blocks that I'm gonna use. So, I don't know what floor or anything like that it should be for the house so basically what you guys can do is i don't know if you guys will actually do it you never know but um what you guys can do if you guys want to is you guys can tell me what um what block floor that i can do it has to be easy like it can't be obsidian block floor because i haven't been to the nether one but two i just that that'd be hard to be too hard for me right now because, yeah, I just started the series. So basically, this is going to go down to about here. And then this all is going to go across the roof. So basically, we're going to have one, two, three blocks tall. So basically, I might actually go one below. I don't exactly know. I'm going to have to see the how the top of the roof ends up looking at the end of everything. So basically, off camera, I will probably put in a floor. Because um, basically, ever, ever, basically, what I'm going to try and do is every Friday have the Let's Play go up. Which I think will be actually good. Because it's Friday, you know, it's just Friday. It's just like once a week. And so yeah, you guys can start um, giving me stuff and I'll do it. I'll, and I'll record the next episode sometime the next week and post it for you guys on Friday. So I'm just, I don't think, I don't know how long it is. I forgot the time, how long my recording has been going. But also that's been going, it, also we had some fast stuff going on there. So if you guys in the comments below can tell me what color or like block the floors and ceiling should be. I think I might do like snowballs, like if I do some stuff like this and then where the where the crafting table go. Then I do, oh my gosh, my build is not feeling right, I'm sorry. Okay, so if I do this, boom, boom, boom. I've never made a snowball block before, this is like history. Okay, okay, so basically now we have two snowball blocks. What do you guys think of the snowballs? Like, we could have, basically what we could do is we could, like, for the flooring, if you guys think that'd be cool, we could have, like, like a quartz floor. Or, like, it's not a quartz floor, but you know what I'm talking about. Let me see, do I still have a stone shovel? 
No, it's getting nighttime. It's actually good timing. But yeah, if you guys think that that'd be cool, or you guys want, um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? If you guys want a floor like this, or what kind of floor do you guys want? And it has to be near, like it can't be like, venture out 2,000 blocks over yonder way and find a place. So let's go to bed. It's nighttime. It's a good, we're gonna have a good night's sleep tonight. It's gonna be great. Let's, no bed bugs got us tonight. Now, for breakfast to today, we are gonna have some fried chicken, our homemade Kentucky Fried Chicken that we made at home and no Kentucky people helped during the making of this video. Um, yeah. Okay, so sorry about that. Um, okay, so let's go over here and I don't know, I don't know what I'm going to try and do, but basically over here, over here, as you can see, if you're wondering what that's going to be, I'm going to basically just have a huge window that goes across that'll go there. I don't know why I did that, but it's going to go across there. And if it looks nice, I might extend it to the ceiling. Two, I just don't know how that would end up looking. Because in my pocket edition world, I have a modern house. And I think that looked pretty cool, but it had tons of windows. So I don't know how it would look. I, I know a few YouTubers have done stuff like this. So I've looked at a few of their builds before I did this. Um, yeah, I think that's going to be it for this video. We did some exploring. We we dug the inside of our initial base. And so yeah, um, before we wrap up this episode, I do want to show you a little bit um, more of what's over here. Um, I don't exactly know personally, but I'm just really curious. And I know that you guys told me to explore a lot this episode. So we're gonna just go, oh, sorry, I just, <laughs> I think I just passed guys. Anyway, so we're just gonna explore over here just a tiny bit more because yeah so there's nothing really over here we have we have nine coal i mean it's not a good thing but i mean we have enough coal um we can go grab this coal over here um so remember our base is that way so let's just collect this coal because you can never have enough coal as i said in the last episode and especially when you're doing a survival world and especially on the computer so let's just get most of this coal because sometimes there are hundreds of coal in one section and yeah let's go get this coal let's go fill it back up fill it back up fill it back up yeah that's what i'm talking about that's what i'm talking about let's do that and over here as i said there are some flatlands which i personally don't think we're ever going to use in this series sorry about that guys if you had high hopes for us to go over there we are probably not um, we might end up doing something over there, but we might just make a huge, enormous base that goes everywhere around the whole mountain, but that's going to take forever. So, I don't know what you guys exactly want the insides of the base to be like. I have some plans. If you guys have anything to add, let me know. Uh, yeah, so I think basically for this series, we're just going to stick on this part of the world, unless we need to go venture out. And also, as I said, one of the goals is to find a wolf. So if we can just find an actual skeleton, that'd be great. So I'm going to just come over here to where the ravine is. Ravine, ravine, ravine. And I'm just going to look over here for a second. Um, let's see. Okay, I just want to come over here. I just want to look at something. See over there, guys. And, and there are monsters over there. There's monsters over there. Oh man, there's iron. Oh, jackpot and iron. I need to do that. I need to get down there. I need to get down there. So I will do that off camera. So yeah, I have a whole list of stuff to do off camera. So after this video is uploaded, I will do a little bit of mining so we can get more tools. And I'm going to work on the house a little bit more. As you guys said, um, um, pick which kind of flooring and ceiling and all that kind of stuff that you want and all that jazz so that's basically it and oh, i was going to say one thing but now i'm blanking on exactly what i was going to say uh let me think let me think let me think hmm yeah i don't really know i was going to say something but yeah sorry that this episode was still a little bit not as entertaining um i'm still getting a little bit better at commentary and yeah 
yeah, I had to take a huge break during the school year. You guys remember that. And I'm going to try to do daily uploads, if not almost daily uploads. Uh, I'm not going to be able to do daily uploads for the rest of this week. I'll probably just, yeah, I, I might even get... The only time I'm probably going to have another video up this week is my Q&A, which I haven't recorded yet, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to get 100 subscribers. And, yeah, I'm not going to have time to do anything for YouTube on it's for Saturday. And probably not even Sunday. So, yeah, I think that's it for the episode. Did I see a creeper? No. Darn. I. Why am I saying darn to creepers? This is insane. But thank you guys for watching the video. It means a lot. And if you guys could drop a like and comment... Uh, the floor and whatever you want and give me good support or bad support. I like them all. Uh, thanks guys for watching. Peace.